done. Smox here from Celebrant Quest. Um, we're back at in uh, Stranded Alien Dawn. Um, this time I thought it would be really fun to just go max difficulty. So I'm going to go the trading outpost. We're going to be in the desertum. I figured that that would be quite hard. The moon is going to be chaos. Difficulty is going to be set to insane. That means I have 10 emergency rations, 7,500 Galacticoins and 50 fuel. So as you can see, it's really low compared to the rest. Um, the game rules as well, um, I'm going to tick Lost Cause. It says survivor skills are set to zero regardless of the biofacts and traits. So I figure that could be quite hard as well. Um, the seed is light space. That's just a random one that's popped up. I don't care. So let's, let's choose that. All right, we've got to choose our survivors. So who do we have? We've got Han, Quinn, and Vicente chosen. So Han, um, what are you? A master hunter, entertainment junkie, age 45. Quinn is 33. He's an explorer and it has a cheerful personality. That could be all right. Vicente is 47 and he's an avid farmer, a haggler, and a kitchen hazard. Oh dear, he can't do cooking. Who can do cooking? Han can do cooking. Okay, anyone good at combat? Han. Okay. Even though I said zero, we've still got some points on the traits. I don't know what's going on with that. So you're good at farming. Uh, anyone good at healing? Vicente as a one. That's okay. Alright, you know what? I'm going to start with these three. I think that's fine. Let's just start with these three. Here we go. I don't know how well this is going to... or how successful this is going to be, but we shall see. Okay, here we are. Here's our new home. All right, let's just pause a sec. What have we got around here? Okay, we've got some broadleaf brush or bush, sorry. Oh, this will be oh, a succulent plant. I've never played the desert, so this will be new for me. Huge desert tree. Okay, we've got some stuff that we can um, have a little look at. We've got rocks. What else? Blade grass. Fallen tree. Oh, what's this one? A dry tree? Um, okay, we've got these plants we can get skin bark off, I, I think, unless it's different. Um, rounded cactuses over there with some spaceship debris. We've got some tube plants over there. Um, okay, so the first thing for us will be... Oh, we've got water here, but um, I don't know. I don't think we... I haven't done anything with water yet, so I don't know. Okay, I think the thing we to, should do first is, that's our trading pod. So we need to get a whole heap of money to win the game. So I think the first thing we need to do is make, um, make a bit of a, a shelter if we can. We don't have the resources to do that. Why don't we make, um, and we'll need to get food as well, obviously. So... What I want to do is let's observe this succulent plant because that's probably going to be quite beneficial for us. And this broadleaf brush, let's do that. Um, in the meantime, maybe the other guy can observe that large tree. Let's just have a little look at our activities. Um, we're all zero. Oh, I see. Yeah, look, we're all zero, so it doesn't matter. So I'm just going to keep those priorities as they are. Um, and we'll just see as we progress, we will obviously need to change that. What's that? There are rations. Okay, we have one day's food supply of rations. Um, let's make a little stockpile. There, that'll be good. And we'll pump this up to three. Because what I'd like to do is, what do I need for that? I think I need to have, do I need anything at all to build that or is that already built? 
Might be already built. And what's this on the ground? Oh, that's our money. Okay. So to have a shelter, um, we'll need to get a few things. Scrap metal, or we'll need sticks and hay. Let's do a sleeping spot. Um, we'll build a couple of shelters anyway. But let's build... There's this, the pile. Stop pile, so we'll build the sleeping spots just next to each other. Forgot to press shift. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Oh, what is that? A long-tailed reptile. Oh, he looks a bit aggressive. Um, okay. We've completed those beds, which is good. We will need to gather some things and... Okay, we've got the small broadleaf brush. Okay, we get sticks from that. That's good. Um, hopefully we'll observe this succulent soon. Let's harvest some of the succulent. Uh, I wonder if... Oh, we can farm those little guys. I don't think we need to do that just yet. Um, let's see. Alright, we still need some wood and some hay. Okay, we got the oasis tree. That's for wood. That's good. So what do we get when we cut these succulent plants? Is it nothing because we haven't observed it yet? Quite possibly. Okay. Um, let's cut down... We'll need some wood, definitely. So let's cut down this oasis tree. A bright leaf plant. Let's get them as well. We'll observe those. I'm not sure if this observation is the, the way to go but we're going to start with that so we're gonna have some um, fallen trees there that's that's fine you guys are eating that's good okay what else have we got we don't want to do an oasis tree let's do our can we do our camp yet no so we need some mats in order to do that Orange mushrooms. Let's observe them. Um, a round cactus. Definitely observe that because I have a feeling that that's going to be very important. Alright, I just want to see. Are there any crashed ships here? No. Okay. I thought we could scavenge some, scavenge, sorry, some metal easily. Um, no, there, that's some insects we don't want to bother. Uh, okay, so let's have a little look at what we can do. So production, we'll need a workbench, that's for sure. Um, so if I'm going to put my shelter here, let's put the workbench just here. And we'll put a chopping block as well out here. There we go. We'll also do a research desk as well because we are going to want to research different um, different things so that we can uh, progress in our journey. All right, you guys are sleeping. That's okay. Where's Vicente? There he is. What were you doing all the way over there? Oh, the cactus. Okay. How long have we got to go? Alright. Gosh, that, that would not be nice. Hypothermia. Han's got hypothermia? It's only mild. What do you mean? It's 35 degrees outside. You'll be fine. You just need something to help you with the heat, I guess. So. Ah, a juice leaf. Okay. 
that's ah good that's their succulents we get juice leaf um crafting of healing balm and distilling the sweet syrup okay cool 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 let's take down some of these because oopsie i don't want to draft you sorry mate because they will be quite useful they'll be quite useful when we um when we need to get some healing bombs okay we've got our research bench okay let's look at our research okay what do we want first tailoring metal refinement pickling toolsmithing construction basics let's do construction basics um hopefully that doesn't bite us let's do some healing balm let's make sure we've just got five of those what else trade goods craft trade goods from various raw materials huh we can do it from wood um hmm let's make sure we've got all right, let's just do 10 trade goods. I don't know. That's obviously not the most important thing to be doing, but that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> um, oh, you know what we should have done with our science? I was going to say when you cook the rations, but it doesn't look like it's enabled just yet. Okay, let's just keep going. What are you guys doing? Han, you're doing the cactus. Quinn, you're doing that mushroom. Vicente, you're doing the crafting. Okay. Let's take down this tree as well. What are you doing? Observing the bright leaf plant. Okay. I'm a little worried about these um, about these reptiles here. I I'm not sure. They look a little bit, mm, actually, do you know what? I'm just not going to. They look a little bit aggressive, to be honest. Let's cut those. We'll mine some of this as well. How much food do we have left? Four rations. Oh my gosh. Um, can we... Oh, we can farm a juice leaf. Mm, I don't think... Do we need to worry about that for now? I mean, we could if we wanted to. But I think we're okay. What I really want to do is I really want to do a shelter. Unlock these blueprints. Acquire the necessary resources. Hint, scavenge scrap metal from a spaceship des debris. I cut hay from tall grass. Hopefully this... Oh, that's not grass. Where can we find some grass? Let's have a little look on the map here. It's a wide-leafed plant. Let's we can observe that as well. That's the same one. Yep. What about any along here? No. Mhm. Mm we want to avoid this nest over here. Of where's the nasties? The nasties are up here, so let's avoid that. Where are the grasses? Oh, a branched cactus. I'm not sure. So let's do that one. Oh, what? Oh, no, that's the long tailed. I don't know. They just look so um, uninviting. All right. Quinn, we've reached intellect one. Well done. Insufficient storage. Okay, no problem. Let's make a little bit more storage. There we go. Oh, I don't need that. Thank you. Less than a day for our food. We've only got one left. Hmm. We argued with Han about the low medicine supply. Okay. Who was that? Quinn did. Okay, well, as long as you boys get along, you know. A glitter cap. Okay. I've never seen mushrooms like these before, so I've named them glitter cap. What do they do? If gathered and cooked when fully matured. Okay, they're for substitute for vegetables. However, they're still slightly poisonous if consumed raw. 
and they can be made into a healing balm. Okay, so we can cut those. Or are you meant to harvest? No, we won't want to do that then. We want to harvest the ones that are mature. It's quite hard to, to get the ones that are. Right, there we go. A shrimp torch. <laughs> okay, so... Mm, I still need scrap metal or hay for my shelters. And we just haven't got there yet. Um, wait, what's that there? Are they sticks? They're sticks. Okay, I'm just not sure what we're going to do then. Maybe we can't do the camp just yet, but we can do a campfire. So we can start to, um, we can start to cook our food. Probably some of these if there are mature ones. Are there any mature ones? Oh, that's a mature juice leaf. Let's get some of that. And this one. Let's see. Great. Okay, everybody's asleep at the moment. How many rocks do you need for that? You need 10 stone. Um, there's 20 there. Okay, so we're fine. Yep. Okay, cool. I know you're chilly, dude. We just need to have, you know, some to be able to do our stupid shelter. But we haven't found um, hay yet, which is sort of holding us back. And so is the farming. All right, let's do a stone table. And they can at least sit near the fire. Does that make sense? Yep, here we go. There we are. Then maybe they won't be... Oh, okay. We've got our fire going. Let's cook some recipes. All right, veggie soup. Yes, great. We'll do that until we've got five. Perfect. What else can we make? Cooked emergency rations. Mm, oh well, we don't need to do that because we don't have any emergency rations left. So that's fine. Okay. Hypothermia, Han. Aggressive in uh, animals. Where are they? They're quite close to our camp? What it? Oh, it's dead. Well, we'll need to butcher that, but until... Ooh, hang on. These guys are killing them. Okay. That's very interesting. Okay. Um, wait, who is this? Han, I don't know Han. Um, I don't think we should. I think we should draft you, take you here. Do you guys have any weapons? I don't think you do. Okay, well, you know what? We're doing it. We're drafting everyone and we're just seeing what happens. So those lizards are going to take care of some of them. Here we go. I don't know how this is going to go. We've got no combat skill. Han, what are you doing, dude? Come over here. There we go. All right. Why are you not attacking? That's very strange. Okay. There's one over there. Let's go and attack that one. Okay, that's all right. Where are the rest? There's one. Let's go and get that one. We'll have to butcher these afterwards. Okay. Okay, they're over here.
There we go. Get them, boys. Look at them with their little knives. <laughs> Alright, excellent work, guys. Undraft you, undraft you, and undraft you. Okay. So. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. You know what? We've got to learn sometime. Let's see what happens. When Han and the lizard... Oh! Nothing happens. That's weird. That's very weird. Okay. Alright, let's have a little look. Risk of a meltdown, Vicente. Vicente, sorry. What's he got wrong with him? Oh, they're only superficial bites. You'll be okay, dude. Quinn is awaiting treatment. What's wrong with you? Can you heal yourself? Uh, Han is coming to heal you. You'll be okay, mate. And then we get to cook our recipes. We'll also do our meat bowl. Let's do until we have five. That was very good. All right, let's speed things up. Okay. That'll be, like, way more than we need food-wise. So that's really good. Vicente's awaiting treatment. Okay, I don't understand why I can't... Okay, so how are we going with our active skills? Just pause a sec. Actually, no, we'll let it go. Because, um... We're about to approach night time and everyone's going to come and sleep. So healing. Han has a healing of one. So let's make him the healer. Um, construction, nobody. Farming, physical. Nope. Nope. Cooking, crafting. Okay. Oops. And a Quinn is interested and he has... A one already in ob observation so let's do that and delivery will make everyone else a two in delivery just so nothing stays outside now Han why are you not treating Vicent Vicente um, I might just wait until let's go to three times speed I don't know if he doesn't die that's fine We'll just wait and see. 177. Hmm, I think it's going down. But we can't... Or can we? No, we can't make bandages right now. I'm going to observe that little, um, what's it called? Like, lizard out there. Okay, I need somebody on cooking, actually. Let's just stop this and... Who is going to be cooking in Capel? Uh, um, let's make you the cook. Han, you're going to be the cook. A trade colony ship, what's this? A trading ship has entered the star system and wishes to trade while in range. The Outer Colonies Federation is a vague trade alliance. They trade with both raw resources and processed goods at decent prices. Okay, well... You can buy technologies? Interesting. Other items... Alright, I wonder if we can get some weapons. Um, dried meat, buttermelon, juice leaf, animal fat, distasteful flowers, uh, metal alloys. Uh, alloys. Um, well, we've only got 7.5k. How much will that get us? Probably nothing. 
We do have some trade goods though. Okay, so how do I do this? How do I say yes please this one? Like that? Okay, I think that's how it goes. So I... So I'm selling the trade goods for 310. Okay, that's cool. Do, do, do. Um, what about apparel? Planetary ownership. Hmm. Okay, food. Mm -hmm. I think that's... What about synthetic tech? No, don't buy that. Metal alloys. We could buy some of these. Um, you know, I don't think we do. I don't think we need it. All right. So we should have a little bit more now. Is that how it works? Update? I don't know. Maybe it like times out and then we make the deal. Okay, so he's cooking. That's awesome. Vicente is still awaiting treatment, but we don't have anything to treat him with. Hmm. We don't have a shelter either. That's that's the bit that's... Oh shit, there's a heat wave. <gasps> Crops grow more slowly and you start to lose... Okay. A heat wave. Oh, considering I can't have... I can't get a shelter, that's actually quite... quite concerning, isn't it? Um, oh well, it is what it is. Isn't it? Chopsticks. Too bad that doesn't give hay. We've got food at least, which is good. Oh, we made a meat soup. That's good. Well done, Han. Oh, and we got... Oh, the smoke leaf. Okay, that smoke leaf got you. Um, well, we can get some of those and maybe trade the ship. Okay. Oh, gosh, I think the scent is going to die, to be honest. Forbid the survivor to go to bed and recover health. What does that mean? Um, wait for treatment. Barrel cactus. Cactus fruit. Okay. We still haven't found anything that is... That is, um, not sticks, but what am I looking for? Um, hay. So we really need some grass. What are these? They're cactuses. Ranched cactus. Um... We'll need to observe these tube plants at some point as well. Okay. Nope. I've got no idea about how we're going to get hay. Um, the only thing I can think is that there is a ship out here. We're going to have to risk going near the insects to salvage some of this stuff. Oh, a humped animal? Oh my god, they've all been killed. Probably by those really aggressive insects. Alright, we should literally just get what we need and then get out. Alright, where's Quinn? Vicente, oh man. I feel... I feel really bad for Vicente because I can't heal him. <laughs> so, okay. What are we working on crafting wise? Slops, trade goods. Let's do, un yeah, until you have 10. That's what I want. Oh, I already had that, sorry. Healing bombs. What else? Let's do animal fats, I guess. They might be interesting. Alright, we've discovered 
Oh. Those carnivorous reptiles. Is a night hunter. Okay, it seems to be wary of predators and will try to avoid a fight. It may be worth hunting for its meat. Excellent. And the tree ball? Oh, sorry, tea ball trees? Um, cooked into it, boiled into a tea. Alright, we also have our aggressive animals here. Some extra beetles. Hmm, I'm inclined to just draft Vicente and just get him to... Actually, no, I'll undraft him for now and I'll just get Vicente to um, go and take on those beetles by himself, honestly, because if he dies, well, you know, he just does. What are we going to do, really? We'll need to get those red plants as well. Hmm... I can't believe we're still not able to build a shelter. That's been the that's been a really hard thing. Okay, so the animals are attacking. Oh, is Vicente recovering? You know what? I don't care. <laughs> we're drafting you, Vicente. Come on, mate. You're going here. Okay. Come on, Vicente, your turn to shine. I know I know you're not happy, darling, but we're gonna have to do this. You can do it. Come on. What the hell? That's it. This is probably not a good idea, you know. Let's uh, I think I need to get everybody on the case here. <laughs> yeah, one second third. Not a good idea. I mean he might be able to. There we go. You guys are okay. They'll take him on. Oh, Han reached combat level one. That's great. Look at them all. They'll be fine. No worries. Okay, Vicente reached combat level one, that's good. And boys come and help your mate out here. Oh, he's fine. He's fine. All right, so let's undraft everyone. We're gonna butcher all these as well. Oh, I know, Vicente, you're just not happy, are you, sweetheart? That's that's the life out here. All right, we've got some leisure um, items. We're gonna place down this beautiful lizard statue. I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna say it's a lizard statue. We do need some more rocks though to make said lizard statue. So let's mine that one. Oh, and that one too. Great. Oh god, Vicente's having a meltdown. What's wrong, honey? Well, you said your skills are improving. You're fine. Okay. We've got 7.8 now. So we got the money through. Um, dee -dee -dee. Uh, it would be really nice if you had some sticks, but you don't. Um, okay, no, I think I think we should just say goodbye to that trade ship. It's really, really doesn't matter. Okay, Vicente, you overate. Okay, that's your stomach. Oh dear. Five per hour, three per hour bleed, five per hour bleed. Oh, someone's vomiting. Who's our... Who is our... Doctor? Yeah, Han. There you go. Han's at least treating people now. Han's at risk of a meltdown. Um, with these activities, I might put Quinn to number two on cooking, just so Han's not always, I guess, just doing it. Um, 
just in case. I'm not sure why I'm thinking that, but maybe it's because Han needs to rest. Uh, I don't know. Let's put this on a two for Han as well, actually. Okay, he's cooking regardless. Oh no, Quinn's gonna die, Vicente's gonna die. Okay, I can't make any bandages though, unfortunately. We've got healing balms, but you know, that's that's about it. So, healing balm from a juice leaf. Let's do healing balm from a glitter cap as well. Um, we'll do it until we've got five and um, see if that helps us at all. Oh, we can harvest that one. Let's harvest this as well. Oh, sugar. They're gonna absolutely die. Harvest, harvest that juice leaf, please. Vicente. Oh dear. A sleep parasite. An unknown parasite is causing me fatigue and drowsiness. For now, there's no cure, but skilled healer, uh, but a skilled healer may be able to think of something. Well, you are the healer, so I'm not sure. Doesn't look good though. Um, okay, it says okay. So we need a skill level that's high in crafting, but that's. That's not us. We can't do that. Okay, it looks like this run is at an end. Alright. How long have we lasted? Six days? That's a good starting point. Um, I think at least. So. Oh my god. We can't even like heal. Oh god, bleeding out in six hours, five hours. Bleeding, but not life-threatening. Can you not... Can you just not heal yourself, though? Damn. That's such a shame. I don't know. The glitter caps, they can't do anything for us now, can they? I don't know. Let's see. Oh, dear. Oh, they're all gonna die. <laughs> they're all gonna die. <laughs> Bleeding, but not life-threatening. That's good. Bleeding out in two hours is Han. He's our doctor, so that's, that's wonderful. And Quinn's bleeding out in two hours as well. So, okay. Well, we made it to day seven. So, in my next try, I have to make it... <gasps> Han died. Oh my god, no, look at him. Oh god, it's disastrous. Oh my god, Quinn's dead too. So it's Vicente who's the only one who's alive. Oh look, he's recovering. No, he's not. He's not recovering. I thought it went up to 43. Oh dear. Alright, this is a slow death. Alright, we need to beat day 7. I'm going to end this one and we'll go to day... And we'll um see if we can start this one again. Attempt number two at the hardest difficulty. So let's get it going. I'm going to do a trading post. We'll try the desert again. The moon is going to be chaos. The difficulty is insane. Um, trip seed, seed, that's fine. Um, I'm also going to do Lost Cause where everybody's skill is zero. Um, I don't know if that's a bad idea or not, but let's just go with it. Okay, so these are the people that we have received. What have we got? Vivian Bazzeri, 65. Um, she has hemophobia, so she can't heal anyone. She's an avid tailor. Uh, Samantha is an engineer and a vegetarian. And Quinn is cheerful and an explorer. Um, now, on attempt number one, we had Quinn. And on another playthrough, I've had Samantha, so I'm going to get rid of those two. We'll keep Vivian. I mean, why not? Um, although I don't like that she can't heal anyone. You know what, Vivian? I'm sorry, mate. You're gone. Um, who else do we have? Let's see. Xander, Night Owl, Gloomy Personality. Yoko. 
She's 68. Mm. Okay, a crafting teacher and she has bloodlust. Um. Alright, let's go with Yoko. She sounds alright. Uh, Vanessa? Let's see. 46. Impeccable healer. Musical prodigy. Sickly. Hmm. And she's a wife of Grayson. Well, let's do her. And where's Grayson? Here he is. Got you. So he's 51. He's an avid carpenter and a slow poke. Um, the avid carpenter. I mean, I think the work speed and everything would probably come into play. But see, something like, uh, where's Yoko? Oh no, I thought I was looking at something different. Never mind. Okay. Look, I think these guys look fine. Is anybody in combat? Oh my gosh, the, nobody likes combat. What about... They're indifferent, you're indifferent to crafting. Okay, that's fine. No one can do... has, you know, not being able... What am I saying? No one has got a trait where they just cannot do it at all. Like, I, I can't take someone really who can't heal. Actually, sorry, Vivian. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Now last time, on attempt number one, I couldn't find anything that was a, um, a shrub or a grass to produce hay. So, ooh, look, there's cactuses. Ooh, ooh, and camels. A humped animal. You know what, let's observe the cactus because I have a feeling that that's going to be quite important. Let's do these bright leaf plants as well. Um, why not this dry tree too? I mean, it doesn't matter. Let's just get that going. Um, okay, what have we got around us? Rocks here. We've got some water here. Um, yep, cactuses here. What else? Oh yeah, some lizards, some silicon plants. Um, those glutch things. What's this? Cactuses. Rocks. Up here we've got the plants that give skin bark. That's good. Um, do you know what? I've just seen up there that we've got... There's a bit of space debris. Ah, here we go. Let's do this space debris. We're going to scavenge that one. Hopefully we'll get some metal because we're in desperate need for some metal um, to make a shelter. Okay, so we learnt the t-ball tree and that gives us t-balls. We've also learnt the tall cactus. Harvesting of distasteful flowers, planting of tall cacti. So the only edible part of the tall cactus are the small yellowish flowers. Okay, belly edible at that. Oh, okay, done. I thought that they would be quite good actually. That's a disappointment. Never mind. Alright, so let's also observe that succulent plant because that will give us something that we can cook. Okay, so yes, we need some beds. Let's put some beds down. Um, do that. One, two, and three. Okay, we've got low food supply. I accept that. All right, that's good. Beds are done. We will need campfire. We obviously can't build that just yet. With some rocks, maybe we could harvest the rocks up and that will help. Okay. Let's put down some storage spots as well. Put them down near our beds. It's not ideal, but it is what it is. And we can do the tall cactus farming and we can also do the t-ball farming non-edibles but the food crops tall cactus hmm. i mean for now we can just um actually for now we can just harvest can't we where are the mature ones actually if i just go orders harvest oh my god can i not harvest any of those no i can't 
Oh no, those I'm harvesting. That's fine. I think I'm harvesting. Is that how that works? No. Can't harvest any of them. I we'll need to observe the tree as well. I know. It's very hot, isn't it? Where are you guys? Okay. Oh, you're scavenging. Okay, that's probably a good idea because then we can make some make some shelters. Alrighty. So. Um, well, we can make a stone table. Oh, cloth blossom. <gasps> Harvesting it gives us cloth. That's awesome. Now we can make bandages. Okay. Oh, no. God, are these never bloody mature? Okay, done. We're going to have to wait until they're mature. Let's put down a table. Just so they're not, like, absolutely freaking out. Oops, didn't want to put that there. Cancel that. All right. So we got some uh, some alloy, which is good. Let's get a bit of a more of a view up here. Okay, and um, insufficient storage space. All right, calm your tits, honestly. <laughs> Let's get that. Oh, I see. They've got to have the the white flowers. Got you. Okay. All right. So. Ah, oh, can finally make a shelter. Okay, let's make a shelter. Let's go over our beds, and let's see if I can make one also over the storage spaces. And they're gonna have to, honestly, they're gonna have to sca um, scavenge a little more, just so we can get this done. Let's observe those. Alright. I don't think we've got a terrible start this time around. Um, can I harvest? Yep, I can harvest you. Harvest you. I don't have any wood just yet, but let's see. Can't make a campfire just yet until I have some sticks. Um, ranching. Let's do a small drying rack. Oh, it has to be out of metal. Okay, I'll wait for the sticks, honestly. Um, the beds. No, that would... Okay, let's do a workbench. A uh, metal workbench? Um, e, I think I'll wait until it's... No, I think I'll wait until we get some wood. Alright. Can I see any trees here for wood? Um, we're definitely going to have to... Oh, you know what? Why don't I just cut these down? I'll just cut some of these. There we go. That'll give us some wood, hopefully. Alright, what? Oh, there's a weapon. Oh, okay. Who wants to brandish a weapon? Let's have a look. Insufficient storage. A new weapon, a laser pistol. Gosh, we must be getting that from, um... Do we have... Has anyone gathered any skills yet? Nope. Alright, let's get rid of all this. Okay, let's just pause for a second. Campfire. Hmm. How do we... I'm gonna have to... Okay, we still haven't finished observing the succulent plant. That sucks. Come on, Vanessa. Go faster, mate. Please, go faster. Alright, we've discovered the juice leaf. Okay. I can't harvest that. Can we harvest these ones? That one we can. No, not yet. 
What about these ones? That one looks big. No. Nope. Ghost deceiving. Alrighty. Doesn't matter. I know that there's insufficient storage. Alright, fine. Do you know what I'm going to do? We'll put more storage just outside. There we go. I mean, it's all outside at the moment. What's going on here? Oh, look, that died. Let's butcher that. And we can cook it. Yes, actually, that's really good. Oh, hang on. No, we don't have a fire yet. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> um, we can make some juice leaf. Oh, no. And we've got aggressive animals. Okay. All right. So we do have a couple of weapons, though. Grayson, let's have a look at you. Where are your... You're a slow poke and a farm owner. Okay. Vanessa's an impeccable healer. Yoko, a crafting tit. She's got bloodlust. I think Yoko should have the melee weapon. She'll have the laser pike. And Grayson, just because you're standing here in base, I'm just going to get you to get the pistol. And now we'll be really lucky if these beetles actually attack some other other animals before they come to attack us. I don't like my chances, but we'll see. Can't treat Grayson. What's wrong with you? Oh, you've got a poisoning? What did you eat, you silly sausage? What did you eat? Okay, let's plant a few oasis trees actually. Oh dear, no, this is not going to work. I was thinking because there's not many trees. Okay, I'm seeing why, because the ground is crap. Um, okay, I'm just going to try. 46% growth, that's not going to work for us, is it? All right, fine. Let's just, gosh, I really need to be able to make a campfire. I need, why have I not been able to get sticks? Why don't we just cut some of these or does that just give us nothing before we observe it? I'm not sure. Let's just give it a go. Oh dear. Grayson is vomiting. Are you okay, darling? Ugh. Oh, it's on the ground. That is gross. And now we've got the animals attacking. All right, this is where it all falls down. Um, have we made the workbench yet? No, we haven't done. Oh, that's right, because we didn't have any wood. Right, I want to make a workbench because I would like to, I would like to um, make some bandages, but it's kind of going to be a little bit too little too late at the moment. Let's go here. I know it's the middle of the night, guys. Let's go. So in this run, we're trying to beat seven days. Oh, I'm running the wrong way. Um, that's the that's the furthest I made it, seven days. Um, and now we've got, what are we on? Four days. So there must be an animal attack every four, or within the four, first four days. Because I think it happened on like, about, mm, no, maybe it was a little bit more into it. I don't know. But we had the same animal attack in the first run and it completely wiped us. Alrighty. Oh, that's it. We did it, dudes. Nice. Let's go. Okay, so... We can observe these and let's butcher the rest and hopefully nobody eats them while they're raw. There we go. Okay. Yep. So get, get treating please. We've got some bandages so we should be much better this time. Um, Grayson man, he's going to He's not looking good. 
Yoko reached healing one. Excellent. So we're going to put Yoko on healing as her number one priority. Has anyone else got any more skills? Medical emergency Grayson. Okay, wait, pause. Yoko, you need to... <gasps> wait, I don't understand. Why... Why can't... Hello? Let's heal yourself then. Oh my god. You know what? Just heal yourself too, Vanessa. <laughs> I changed my mind, Yoko. Yoko, just heal yourself. Oh, insufficient medicines. What medicines did we have? Oh no. Okay, Vanessa, I need you to make this wooden bench so that we can make bandages so that no one dies. That's the first thing. So, rush, rush, rush. Come on. How are you looking, Grayson? Oh my god. No, Grayson's dead in 10 hours. Come on, Vanessa. Chop, chop. Mush, mush. Oh my lord, seriously? Oh yeah, she is. She is. Okay, can you please heal Grayson? Why don't you construct the metal shelter? And then let's craft craft some bandages. We'll craft until we have five. Yoko, you craft the bandages. Alright guys, let's go. Oh my god, Vanessa stopped to eat. Jesus. Wait, I thought you were making... Oh, you can't... Okay, we can't do the scrap metal apparently. Okay. Where's something else? Here. Oh, we can't salvage that. Can we scavenge anything else? I wish I could zoom out even further, but I can't. Okay, scavenge, salvage that please, Vanessa. Yep, there we go. Um, I'm not sure about this. I think Grayson's gone. We've got seven hours. Alright, Yoko, can you please heal Grayson? Alright, and then we desperately need these- Ah! Look at these cotton plants. Oh my gosh. That is so good. Alright, great. How are you looking now, Grayson? Oh my god, you still ble- What? I don't understand. So you need antibiotics. Okay, Yoko, can you please craft the bandages again? How are you going, Vanessa? You're still scavenging there. Oh dear me. Okay, so Grayson looks like he's not going to do so well. Can you please heal Grayson? How's Vanessa doing? Uh, I don't know. Grayson, his health is 22. Oh my gosh, can we please craft some more bandages please, sweetheart? I know Grayson is a medical emergency. Mate, he's dead in six hours. How's Vanessa doing? <gasps> We've got a colony ship trade. Hang on. Pause. Okay. Right. What do we need from him? There's dried meat, cactus fruit, etc. Tea balls, animal fat, hides, leather, veggie, leather, cloth, liquid fuel, metal alloys, and carbon nanotubes. Okay. Um. Bandages. He has no bandages. Oh, that's cloth. Sorry, cloth. Let's have a little look here. Cactus fruit for cooking. Dried meat for cooking. Um, animal fat. What's this used for? Production of other materials such as liquid fuel. No, we're not interested in that just yet. What about hides? Da -da -da, leather. Tailoring and construction, veggie leather. Um, I could buy some metal alloy actually. Wait, am I selling it or purchasing it? I want to buy it. I want to buy some. Buy 10. Okay, so they don't have any metal alloy, but I do. Okay, that's interesting. Alright, so their numbers are here. Veggie leather? We don't have any veggie leather. Wait, why would we be selling our non-existent veggie leather?
Why is it costing us? Oh. No, I'm an idiot. Wait, what? Sell for 10, sell all. I don't get it. Okay, I don't think this trader can help us. Let's keep going, guys. Grayson is literally dead. Five hours. All right. Um, can you please... Oh, why don't you feed Grayson then and just make him a little bit happier because what's he's gone off to heal herself, which I guess is okay. Okay, craft bandages. I know you're tired. I'm sorry. Okay, I know about research. Thank you. We've got bigger fish to fry right now. Oh gosh, he's dead in three hours. What about her? You guys are okay, but honestly... Can you do the metal shelter? At least that might help a little. What have we got? Dead in one hour, mate. Um, as soon as Vanessa is finished crafting... <gasps> Grayson's vomiting. Oh dear. Put them down. Okay, now treat... No, 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 not, uh, no, no, I want you to, oh, god damn. No, I want you to treat him. Oh my god, are you serious? Okay, I'm going to draft you. Oh, seriously? I need you to heal Grayson. He's dead in less than an hour. Oh, crap, he's gone. Ah. Oh. Okay, Grayson is gone. We need to build the grave. Oh, I'm so sorry, Vanessa. Vanessa's gonna not be happy now because her husband just died. Whoopsie. Let's bury Grayson out here. You know, this was his favorite spot. Um, oh, dearie me. Okay, but before. Oh my god, we can butcher. No, that's terrible. I'm gonna unequip though. We're going to unequip all this shit because we need that. Oh my god, I can't believe that you can you can butcher him. I'm going to bury him. Oh, hang on a second. You'd rather me do that? Okay. Well, at least we have two survivors left. That's probably better than nothing. Um, we can still make some bandages, which is really good. Um, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot. Oh no, it says cloth. Uh, sometimes it goes with, um, you can make cloth out of the synthetic material and I didn't want to do that. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we lost Grace and, uh, that was on day five. Oh look, we're saying a little prayer. That's nice. And then she goes and cuts, cuts some bugs up. <laughs> Hey, you know what? Someone's going to do it. All right, now that Grayson is unfortunately not with us anymore, what do we need to look at for the activities? Oh, Yoko is healing three. Okay, this is going to be quite difficult. <laughs> Hunt, um, who has the gun? She will have the gun now. I'm going to give that to her. And she's going to now be our hunter, Vanessa. Um, harvester, either cutting, whatever, um, scavenging, Vanessa can do the scavenging because she's quite good at it. No one's cooking, alright, that'll be Yoko, um, crafting, tailoring, assemble, observe, research and deliver, neither, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so she's got an infection now. E, we need some antibiotics. Okay, let's production. Let's do some research. Um, let's put our research bench just here. We need some more wood, so let's cut that down, and we'll cut this one down as well. Um, you know what, Vanessa? Whatever you're doing, just can you stop, please? How about you construct the research desk? That would be quite helpful. Am I going mad? I could snap at any moment. God, I hope not. Um, her happiness is low. And her health is... Oh, her health is okay. She's got an infection in her, my, her right foot. Vanessa has whole body poisoning. 
does not sound good. Where is Vanessa? What are you doing? Butchering. Uh, okay, look, look, just, yeah, whatever, just butcher them, I don't care. And what are you doing? Awaiting treatment. Um, no, I'm sorry. You can't wait for treatment. You're gonna have to keep going. Oh my god, why are you praying, please? Alright. Taking a walk. Alright, I suppose that's allowed. Where's Vanessa? Oh, good on you, Vanessa. Alright. And... We need, yes, we need to cut down a tree. Which I believe we're doing that one. So Yoko, you can cut these trees after you're finished. Oh, okay, whatever. You can harvest those. Make some more. Make some more bandages anyway, so that's fine. Um, you, I'm sorry, you're not waiting for treatment either. Sorry, girls, we just can't let you. Alright, so. Let's look at the research desk. Um, sorry, this um, science research tab I meant. Um, okay. Emergency rations. Pickling, wine making, it's a bit decadent. Weaponsmithing. Mm. Safes. Animal taming, camp management. We are here to stay, but mere survival is not sufficient. We must come together and establish strategies to maintain separate camps. Hmm, okay. Long distance travel. Spaceship deconstruction. I think let's research that one because that's going to help us, I reckon. Okay, remembering the dead. Death it has been our constant shadow ever since we crash landed on this planet, sometimes barely visible, sometimes all too real. We wish to honour our fallen fellows and remember our loved ones who, whose graves uh, lay scattered across the universe. We can gather at the graveyard at 1500. Yes, of course. Why not? Awaiting treatment. I said I thought I said you can't await treatment. You need to work. I'm really sorry. Sounds really harsh, doesn't it? But they need to work. <gasps> oh no, aggressive animals. Are you kidding me? Um, hmm. Where's my camp compared to them? Up here? Oh no. Can you please go and fight those Dracker and those other things first, please? Because we're not going to... We're not really going to... We're not going to make it. Oh, a dust storm. Oh, shit. Yeah, we're not going to make this one. We've got 21 metal scrap. I wonder if I can kind of enclose this camp, this shelter here. 30. Oh. Let's try anyway. Maybe, because she's scavenging, maybe she'll find a few more bits. Oh, Day of the Dead. Oh, is she mourning? She's crying. Oh, sweetie. I'm so sorry. That's very sad. Oh, she's having a meltdown, and while she's partying? Um... There's just something not right here. Honey, I'm so sorry, and the insects are going to get us, so I really need you to pull your shit together, please. Okay, I hope that animal's just ghost somewhere else. Can you please just go elsewhere? Um, we're going to have to just move. We're going to have to move. I'm sorry, Yoko. I need you to go. And what about Vanessa? Can I draft you while you're having a meltdown? I can't. Okay. Oh dear. What can I just go next to you and like make you fight? Oh, far out. Okay, this is not good. No, because she's... Uh, she's going to run away because she's not drafted. Alright. 
I need you to stop having a breakdown. I need you to stop having a breakdown, Vanessa. Damn it. Alright, Yoko's just taking it all. Come on, Yoko, you can do it. Lucky she's got a a lancy thing. That's right. Get him, get him. That's it. Alright. Oh dear. Come on, Vanessa. Alright. Vanessa, I'm just gonna have to leave you. Yoko, it's all on you, sweetie. You have to heal yourself. There's also a dust storm coming, guys. Oh, Vanessa's over it now. Thank gosh. Okay, so you're healing yourself. Why don't you heal yourself? I don't understand that. Why don't they heal themselves? Um... That's weird. Do I need to tick something like Rimworld? No. Alright. Shared their fear of hunger with Yoko. Oh, I'm sorry, Vanessa. Um, are you hungry? Oh yeah, we don't have a freaking campfire. Dear me. Let's make a stone one. Do I have stone? Yes, I do. Is it going to be too hot if I put it in there? Maybe. Let's make it outside here. You probably actually, I don't know if you've eaten in a while. Let's be real. Um... 22% fullness, 28. Okay. Are you eating the raw meat? No, 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 no. We can't have that. Okay, so. No, we don't make tea. Let's make... Let's make veggie soup. And we'll do it until we've got three. And then we'll make meat soup. And we'll do that until we've got three as well. Okay, you, I need you to cook. And you. Can you... Where are those bugs? Oh my god, where are the bugs? Oh, look at that. Hang on. Let's butcher that. I need you to butcher. Oh, unless that thing's going to eat it first. Yeah, they, well, they are carnivorous, aren't they? Okay. Oh, no, she's butchering. That's great. Oh, and we got a hide. Awesome. Alright, so. The dust storm didn't really do much. Alright, who's cooking? Yoko's cooking. Okay, you're eating some soup, that's good. And what are you doing? She's scavenging, that's good. You're awaiting treatment. You won't get it. You will not get the treatment. There is no treatment. <laughs> there is no treatment. Um, Mate, Yoko. Oh my gosh. You're going to die. Yoko's going to die. If you're going to die, Yoko, at least make yourself useful. That sounds terrible. All right. 
right, so we've made it to day seven, almost day eight. So our biggest concern has been have, has been the animal attacks. That's been our biggest concern. So we need to work out how to do that. We need to get those plants that have the cotton balls to make bandages really quickly. We also need to scavenge from the, the fallen like spaceships really quickly to make our um, shelters or we need to get um, some wood chopped quickly but there's hardly any wood here in the desert um, I say that as there's some wood behind me here so let's cut them Okay, we're on day eight. I honestly don't... Oh, look, she's making the shelter. That's good. All right, I don't think we're going to make it much past day eight because Yoko is... Yoko is going to bleed out, I think. Well, she says bleeding but not life-threatening, so I don't know. And then Vanessa, she's all right. How could it not be life-threatening if you're bleeding out like you know um maybe she can craft some bandages and then she can treat herself maybe that's i thought we had bandages but clearly that's just cloth not bandage that might help the situation a little bit at least we have a full shelter this time okay She's healing herself, that's good. All right, we can get this right leg worked out. Aha, okay. Okay. Awaiting treatment, you can't await treatment. You can recover your health though. Which you are doing, which is great. Oh my gosh, we might actually make it. Um, I wonder... We need the chopping block, don't we? Let's put that out here. Okay. So Vanessa is... Okay, so she's fine. She's got a little bit of poisoning, but she's fine. Um, got low food. How is Yoko doing? <gasps> Yoko died? Oh my god. Okay, and we've got aggressive animals. Oh my gosh. Even us, uh, man, I don't know how this is going to go. Can we win from one person? She's got full health, but the animals are attacking. Oh, we got a new weapon, a pulse rifle. Is that better than our current weapon? How do we know? Let's have a little look. She's about to walk past those... She's about to walk past those um, animals that are going to eat her. How do I go to weapons? Doesn't matter. Alright. I don't know if... Yeah, alright. Doesn't matter. I can't believe Yoko died. Vanessa, what are you doing? Maybe you should try to shoot some of these animals. Would that be a good use of your time? It is dark though, so you won't be very good at it. Oh no, the animals are attacking. Yeah, this is quite bad. Come on, Vanessa. It's too dark. Alright, kite, kite. They move away quickly. Oh no, you know what Vanessa, why don't you just stand your ground dude. Okay, this is the end, this is the end. Vanessa is fighting valiantly but look at all of those, oh no, this is bad. 
This is very bad. Okay. No, this is... <laughs> oh no, she's down! Wait, she's down! She's fainted! Ah oh, no! Alright. That's weird. Why have they stopped attacking her? Is that because she's fainted? Are they attacking her? No. Oh, they're gonna wait till she resuscitates, probably. <laughs> this is silly. Alright, what happens now? I guess she'll get back up and they'll start killing her again. Oh no, defeat. Oh man. Oh, okay, so we got to what was it? Was it day eight? Alright. Let's start all over again. Um what does it say here? Seven days, twenty-one hours. Okay, let's try attempt number three. We'll go a new game. We'll do a trading outpost. I liked that. We'll do the desertum. Chaos. Insane. <laughs> Final pound. <I> <laughs> um. We can do lost cause. Why not? I mean. What does it really negate? It kind of negates choosing anyone. So let's do it without them completely losing their skills. Alright, we need new people. Um, alright. Nova, who are you? Oh, she's good at combat but she and healing, but she can't do any research. Okay, noted. She's a sergeant major. Obtuse. Oh god. She's dumb. <laughs> Rita. Cousin of Rakar. She's 29. Let's have them all below 30. That's interesting. She can do farming. She's okay at combat. Okay, let's do somebody who's a healer. Um, 34. No, we're going to do below 30 and see what we come up with. Sorry, you are 30. Nope. 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 This lady looks very sad. Paulette. Oh, she's got pretty eyes. Melody. Oh, 26. Krista Yule. She's a clumsy genius. Hmm. That might be what we need, actually. Ken. He's kind of cute. <laughs> um, okay. Let's do it. Attempt number three. Okay. Okay, I'm going to pause just to see where we are. Oh, look! Okay, we've got lots of salvageable um, crushes next to us. That's good. We've got a fair few animals around here. We've got bark skin there that we can use for leather. First thing I want to do, though, is I want to look at this blight plant because I want to get those four bandages. Do we have any more that are closer to our spot? Um, probably, oh, these ones here. Okay, let's do those. Definitely need to observe those. What else should we start with? Let's start with these. The mm, Yeah, start with the dry tree. And you know what? Let's start with this broadleaf as well. Because um, that'll give us sticks. Although we need something for food. That's sticks, bandages, wood. And we also need food. Um, I don't think these plants give us food. The succulents. Let's see. Do, do, do. Cactus. Um, they just give us the, I think the flowers that can be eaten. Oh, blade grass. That's for hay. So we do need to get them as well. 
Um, we could kill some animals for food for now, just while we're getting set up. What about these little cactuses? I can't remember what they give. Um, yeah, let's start with that. We'll start with those. Now, who does what? Wait, let's pause again. Let's do our priority. So who is our healer? Nova. She's healer number one. We might make Rita doing healing at number two. Why not? Construction. Yep, Krista can construct. Hunting. Oh god, Nova's really good at hunting. So let's do her hunting. Oh, good. Rita's good at harvesting. Cutting Nova. Ranching is Rita. Planting is Rita. Okay, scavenging. Yes, is Nova. Mining, probably Nova. <laughs> Cooking. Alright, Krista, you're up. Let's do her at number one as well for that. Crafting, that's fine, whatever. Assembling, observing. Oh, Krista's very good at that. Okay, research as well. And delivering. I say Rita does delivering. Nova. Mm, let's make her a deliverer, number one as well. Alright, let's go. So what we're going to have to... Oh, this is interesting. So these animals are attacking this one. So we might be able to get some early meat from them. That'll be really good, unless the animals eat it. Oh, are you bleeding out? Nice. Aha, there we go. Let's butcher that. And let's get a shelter down. Um, can I... No, that's just flavor, is it? Those little pink ones? Okay. Let's get a shelter. Oh, okay, we've got no place for a shelter right now because we haven't got any metal. So we will... Oh, God, I always do that. I always forget to press shift. Shift for the beds. There we go. Um, we will have to scavenge from here. So that's good. Nova's doing that now. Oh, look at these. That's great. These guys are going to give us a little bit of food by hunting all of the animals nearby. So we'll just keep an eye on, on that. Oh, a t-ball tree. Awesome. Um, okay, we're not necessarily going to um, do any farming just yet. Okay, let's watch this animal. You know what we do need to do? I wonder if we can put... No, we can't do the campfire just yet. That's all good. Do need to mine some stone, so let's get some of this going. We're almost got this bright leafed plant. Oh, we've scavenged some boots, that's pretty good. We've got the bright leaf plant almost done. The reason why that's important is because we will have to make some bandages. Because um, without the bandages, then we will be in trouble. Okay, we get sticks from the small brushes. Small bushes? Small bushes, sorry. <laughs> Let's cut some of these because we will need sticks. We will need a stockpile as well. So let's put down a stockpile. Da, da, da. Oh, great. We can do a campfire. We've just got the cloth blossom. Excellent. Okay, let's do a stone campfire. We'll do that near our beds just so. I guess we don't get cold. This is so good having this. Alright, where is the cloth blossom? Are these mature? Yes, they are. Okay, that one is. That's the only one. So, um, let's just have a look down here. I thought there was some more. Maybe it's more over this way. Yes, there we are. There's one. So we want those because we really want to make those bandages because I have discovered that with this, um, I guess it's the moon that's doing it, but with this moon you just get attacked all the time. 
and um, we really will need to kind of ward against that. We can grow them if we need. Okay, so first of all, we need our shelter. So we're going to use scrap metal for now until we get hay and things like that. So let's put it over our beds. Let's also do another shelter with scrap metal just next to it so that we can have some storage spots. We'll do some stockpiles. There we go. <clears throat> and we're scavenging that. We'll scavenge or salvage that as well. How are you going, little animal? He's alright. Oh, well, they've kind of got those bleeding, you know, the um, bleeding icons, I should say. Okay, cool. So we've got our things that we're transporting. Um, what are you doing? Krista, you're transporting. Nova, you are transporting. What are you doing, Rita? Transporting. Oh, okay, cool. All right, let's make our... Let's make, what am I looking for? Production. We need a workbench, so we need wood. Okay. Uh, we can chop these trees down. Um, that's what I'm going to do with this one. We'll see how much wood we get from this. I'm not exactly sure. Okay, food's going to be a little bit of an issue if we, aha, we've got our campfire down. All right, so let's do some meat soup. Um, we'll do until we've got, say, maybe three, because there's not very many of us. Also, we'll do the cooked emergency rations, because I really would like to make sure that my, my guys are getting as much happiness as possible. What does that tea do, actually? Oh, it just gives happiness. It's a pain relief. Great. We need that, because when we get attacked, and we will get attacked... <laughs> We will definitely need that. Um, okay. So Krista is cooking. We will need a table. Let's make a stone table. Because we need to eat um, at a table. It just makes us a little more happier. And that can only be a good thing. So we've got insufficient storage. Ah. I'm not too worried about that for now. All right, I get it. Um, can I make a wooden shelter? I need hay. All right, so where was the grass? Here it is. Okay, I really need you to observe that because we need to... What if I cut this? Oh, it does give us hay. That's all right, but if we observe it first, that might be a good idea. So we've got someone making those, the table and the chairs. We can mine some more stone. It's, ooh, Rita's got hypothermia. Okay. We've scavenged some good stuff, some alloys and some, what was that, scrap metal? So hopefully we can make this shelter. That'd be really nice, actually. I wonder if we got enough... Yes, the workbench. Here we go. Um, I don't have the resources just yet, but let's put the workbench just here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put the research desk here. And we'll make them both out of wood. Um, maybe I should make them out of metal, but I feel like wood is okay for now. Alright, I need a tree. Just pause a sec. I need a tree to cut down. Um, the table trees, maybe the... We can cut the ones that aren't... That are the juvenile ones, I guess. And the ones that... Uh, so, yeah, we can cut the juvenile ones and the ones that are mature we can harvest from. So let's do that. We'll get some wood from there. I don't know if that's a good strategy. Oh, I think that wasn't one. Um, I don't know whether it's a good strategy or not. Okay, they're going off. That's awesome. Okay, we've got one shelter done, which is great. A 
and there's our second shelter. So now the things that are in our stockpile, at least they're out of the the um, the elements, which is great. Now I want to see. I've never done this before, but I want to see if if I put a shelter here. Will will it like make a little door that we can go into the shelter or is that a no? Hmm, I'm not sure. Because it'd be nice for it to be fully enclosed, you know what I mean? Let's try it and if it doesn't work then we'll just take it off. There we go. We'll get a drying rack as well because that will be really useful. There we go. So what is the thing? We're probably ugh, not really well placed for food. I might have to look at maybe um, taking out some of these animals. What's that there on the ground? Oh, hang on a second. We can butcher that. That's fantastic. Any other ones around here? What's oh wait are they dead yes great okay you're sleeping that kind of helps us to be honest let's have it harvest these up for bandages um I want to put that on the list to observe as well come on girls let's go gosh they're taking a long time well we're into day three. Um, does anyone have a weapon? Actually, let's... Oh no, let's keep it going. Um, we don't have any weapons, do we? Do we have any... No, we don't. Okay, so we just have um, insufficient fuel, so we need some more sticks. So all we've got is our little... Every colonist is given like this little brandishing knife. So that's all we've got. Um, what do those boots do? Cold tolerance, four. Okay, so who's got hypothermia? Um, Krista and Rita. Cold tolerance of three. Okay, so you can put your synthetic boots on Krista. Alright, cool. I feel like we're going going well. Um, let's t uh, yeah okay so we've got these butchered that's good. Let's make sure we've got enough um, where's our cooking there it is our campfire. We've got meat soup, emergency rations and tea balls. What else can we do? Um, that's it so far because we don't have any veggies. Okay, so we've got the Dramata for a peaceful herbivore. Okay. Great. Low food supply, three days. Okay, I wonder. Let's do... <laughs> Let's do this statue so that the ladies are happy. A new resource, tea. Oh, was I yet to make that? Scavenged eight med packs? First aid kits. Oh, great. Wonderful. Um, let's put another storage stockpile just here. And. Oops. Just want to put that next to. Okay, we've got our blade grass. We've also got our aggressive animals. Let me just put this storage stockpile just near the fire. That's all I want. And then another one on this side as well. There we go. Maybe that will enable us to bring some more things over. I still am not sure if they can get into the shelter once this other section is created. So 
Where are our aggressive animals? There they are. Okay, this is where we get absolutely annihilated. So, Rita, can you... Oh, that's the research bench. Nope, we're all good. Okay, here we go. Somebody needs to make these bandages, please. Um, who is good at that? I don't know. I guess it's assembling. Why don't you just craft the bandages, please? Oh, a synthetic vest. Great. All right. I hope those animals hold out a little. I hope they go and attack these other animals that are around. Although I want that one's dead, so <laughs> I'm not going to be attacking that one. Um, let's observe those. Okay, got them drinking tea, etc. So, what do we need for that? Um, who's our who's our person that constructs things? Construction, Krista. Where are you, mate, Krista? Construction. Oh, missing resources. What are you missing? Oh, you're missing hay. Okay, got you. So we need to go and get some more of this hay grass here. Okay, I really hope those animals just attack other things. Okay, here we go. So, these animals are attacking, which is not good. Oh gosh, there's another dead one. Um, Alright, let's gather everyone. Let's gather everyone up here. I'm hoping... I don't know if this works, but I'm hoping that the animals will attack each other rather than attacking my colonists. I mean, the animals are coming over. I don't know what they're going over there for, but at least if we break them up a little like this, we've got a little bit more of an opportunity to maybe outrun. I don't know. Not this is not happening. So. Um, I don't know. No, keep going, Krista, because I really want you to, I really want you to be able to, <laughs> maybe, if it's, if it can work, yeah, I want you to be able to get these animals to be attacked instead. Is this working? Hello? No, it's not working. Okay. All right, girls, move out. Oh, that's such a shame. Okay, I thought that I thought that I'd found a way to make it a little better, but I hadn't, so that's a shame. Maybe if these weren't herbivores, maybe if they were more aggressive animals, it would actually work a little better. But I don't think it's going to. All right, did we get any bandages? I have no idea. We do have the first aid kits, but I don't really want to use the first aid kits. Oh, or do I? I'm not sure. Um, actually, you know what? Just pause a sec. Is that an option? Um, where, what about, maybe it's on the characters themselves. Medicines. Medical items used to treat various health conditions. Um, Let's take out the medicines because I just want to, I don't know what that does, but if we can say, um, eat, drink the tea and use the bandages instead of using the first aid kits, that would be way better. All right, come on girls, let's do this. Oh, Krista reached combat one. Okay. We've got a lot of bugs here. Although... Alright, how many more can there be? Let's have a look. Okay, it looks like that's about it. That's it. Okay, beautiful. Undraft you guys. Oh, geez. And we want to observe the beetles. Um, oh, why are you? Excuse me. Yeah, undraft you. <laughs> um, 
we should definitely butcher all of that as well. So let's see what's happened. Who's okay? You're doing the self healing, and then you're going to heal others. Is that what it is? Do you know what this person, Krista? Can you please just? Oh, incapable of crafting. Darn. Um, Rita, Rita, my mate. Can you get up and just craft some bandages, please? That'd be really helpful. Here she goes, good girl. And then hopefully Nova will finish healing herself, and then she'll heal Krista. No. Heal Krista, please. Okay. How's everyone doing? Let's have a little look. Okay. Oh, dear me. Krista is bad. What about... Who's this one? Rita. Oh, what about Nova? Okay, she's healing Rita. Krista, why don't you drink some tea? Where's the tea? Um, can I do this? Drink tea already relaxed. Ooh. Okay, that's not how that works. I'm not exactly sure. Is she gaining health though? 118. No, she's bleeding. Okay, well once, once Nova is okay... I'm gonna have to get Nova to get up to make more bandages, I guess. I I'm not Nova, I meant Rita. I'm gonna have to, I think I'm gonna have to use a med. Oh god, now a dust storm. I'm gonna have to use medicine on Krista, otherwise she's gonna die. So I'm gonna heal Krista using the medicine. Otherwise, it's just lights out for this run. Okay, looks like she's getting better. She's down to 100 health. 99 health. Do you know what? I'm going to turn them all on to medicine, honestly. Yeah, otherwise, I, otherwise the run is over, basically. Oh, okay, I see she's taken some tea. Or maybe the doctor uh, administers that, I don't know. Here she goes, okay. So Nova's healing herself. Okay. Oh man. So she's recovering, that's good. She's... it says bleeding but not life-threatening. So let's just watch this, 145. So she... her health is going down. What about Nova? Alright. Rita, did you make more bandages? I think she did. Okay. So what did we need... Well, that's the research bench. Doesn't really matter. All right, Rita is injured, but Nova is healing her. All right, that's good. Is Nova healing her? No, please heal her. <laughs> She's like, sorry, go on to sleep now. Okay. So I think that I would love to let them recover, but I feel like when morning comes. We're actually going to wake them up. And actually, let's manage their schedule. I think we should relax just before we go to bed. Um, sleep from 2300 to 6. And then I guess you can do anything for the other two hours of the day. Um, I know in RimWorld you can do a cycle where you have a cycle where you sleep twice in the day. I mean, that might not be such a bad thing. Um, but we'll see how this goes. So, is she sleeping? She is sleeping. Okay, I thought maybe she was just resting. I was going to say, if you're if she's resting, she can just get up. Alright, great. So they're eating. Um, 
Oh good, Rita is cooking, that's awesome. Okay, and what are you doing, Rita? Can you please see what you need to do for the shelter? What do you need? You need hay. Alright, Rita, can you come and cut this hay? Because I'd really like you to do... I really want them to try to get that... To get this um, shelter built. That'd be very helpful. Alright. So, everyone seems to be back on track, which is great. Rita reached physical too. I guess that's good. Um, oh yeah, right. Now, okay. Who needs jackets, etc.? Where are you going? Oh. Oh my gosh, look at all these. Um, okay. Where's my shelter? There it is. I just got lost for a second. Okay, this is being constructed. Let's see what happens if they can get in or out of the shelter. Wait. Who's the constructor? A constructor. Krista. <laughs> Where's Krista? Construct the stick shelter, please. So, how do you get in and out of the shelter? can't reach the campfire damn okay well that um, that tells us all I need to know copy it reconstruct it deconstruct it okay ah oh, that's a shame we can't move it so you'll have to deconstruct the stick shelter that's a shame all right let's do a shelter over here over where we're doing our work Um, okay. Not bad. I don't think. Not terrible. Oh, a trade colony ship. Okay, so they have meat, cactus fruits, vegetable oil, slop, pickled vegetables. They've got hides, leather, cloth, liquid fuel, metal alloys. No apparel and no weapons. That's a shame. Um, let's sell our tea because we can make more of that. We're going to keep the first aid kits. Uh, what's a chew rot? I don't know what that is. Okay. Cloth. We've got 64 cloth. We're okay. We don't. Oh, yeah, we do have some hides. We don't have pickled food. I don't think we need this though. Let's accept that trade for now. Um, because we can make more tea. That's not a not a concern of mine. Where are the tea trees? And we can go and get some more of that for t for the tea. Where are the tea trees? Da, da, da. Am I going silly? Where are the trees? Did we cut them all down? Oh no, here they are. I knew there was somewhere. There we go. So we'll harvest those so we can make some more. Oh my gosh. Let's butcher those. Um, okay. I think we're doing okay. Honestly. Let's butcher that. We may as well now observe these plants. It'd be really nice to get some weapons going. But we don't have anything. We can't make anything, I mean. We can make animal fats. Why don't we? I don't know. May as well. Trade goods. Now that would be a good idea, actually. Because when the next trade ship comes... Um, oh, actually, trade goods. I don't want them to do it from scrap metal, and I don't want it to do it from wood. Let or hey, let's just do it from stone. Okay, aggressive animals as well. 
and slop. I don't want slop because it makes our colonists very unhappy. So, where are our aggressive animals? Here they are. Oh dear. There's only 12 of them. God, we really need... We really need some... Um... Who's got an infection? This, this animal? Well, I can't help you, dude. Oh god, Rita. Rita's very far from from base. Okay, these animals are going to attack soon. I'm wondering if I should actually draft them and come and attack. Where is Rita? I'm going to draft her too. And she's going to come and attack as well. If I preempt this, it might be better. I mean, I could be wrong. Krista, get in there. Okay. And attack that one. Here we go. Now they come to us. Why are you not attacking? Come on, we need you to attack. No, 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 attack, attack. <laughs> Here we go. Oh my god, attack the animals. Maybe I keep pressing the ground accidentally. There we go. Okay, so well, we still haven't observed these guys. Let's observe that one actually, and then we'll butcher these. Well, that's really good. I feel like that was not bad. That could have been way worse, that one. Nova's going to treat these injuries though. I wonder. Treatment doesn't require medicine. Let's take off the medicines again. Because I'd like to keep it like we did last time where we only use the medicines in the case where it was dire. You know? Nova, can you heal yourself? Nope. Oh no, is this going to be... Recru treatment requires bandages. Alright, so she should hopefully get up and maybe heal herself? I don't know. Okay, and what's Krista doing? Oh good, she's looking at those mushrooms. So these mushrooms, I think they're for food and medicine? I can't remember exactly. Um, Rita, what are you doing? Okay, glitter caps. Oh great, okay, so you can eat them and have a healing balm. Great, okay. That's lovely. So... Let's try a uh, healing balm. That is at our workbench here, is it? Yes. Glitter cups. I don't have any. Okay. Need to actually harvest them first. <laughs> um, we can plant some glitter cups. I mean, it wouldn't be the worst idea. There we go. We'll harvest those. Um, let's look at our farming things. Mm. I mean, if we did have little farms, it would mean that we wouldn't have to go far places to get our stuff. What's that? 75%? Um, yeah, I can deal with that. 75%. Let's do that. And that's our mushrooms. What else? Our non-edibles. Let's do some cloth. Okay, that's in 75% as well. There we go. What else? T-ball tree? Oh, gosh, why not? <laughs> why not? There we go. And our grasses. Yeah, blade grass will make that. There we go. Beautiful. And what else do we have? One last one. All oh, the small brushes. A small... Why do I keep saying that? Small bushes. <laughs> Alright, let's just go across here. Feel 
cannot exceed this length. Oh, okay, my bad. That's all. Right, let's do this. We've got a heat wave. We do have some extra clothing in here. So we've got this jacket. It's for cold tolerance. Hmm. And the shoes. I don't know. I think we're okay, honestly. Um, what else can we make? We really need to get our bench going. We need wood. Okay. Um... Let me scour the landscape. <laughs> Let's see. Keep your eyes peeled, folks. Oh, there we go. Um, I want to observe that first, though. I don't want to just cut it down because then I might be missing something really good from it. So we'll cut those. There we go. All right. Oops. Yep. Yeah. There we are. Perfect. I feel like we're going really well. I mean, it could just be me. Or are you still bleeding out? Oh my gosh. Honestly? Okay, so Krista's the only one who's full health. Which is weird, considering she was the one who um almost died. Let's just watch Rita's health. She's at one. Oh, God. Pain mild. Okay. So we need some more tea. Is that what you're telling me? Oh, here's some tea trees over here. Let's harvest them. What's that there? Gosh, some more animals. May as well butcher them. Oh man, I can't believe that these girls might die. Because I don't have anything to treat them with. Oh, I forbid the medicine. Um, oh, fine. Just use the medicine. I really need you to be. Oh, I can... Aha! I see. I didn't realize that. There we go. I didn't know I could open that panel. Okay, there we go. Let's see if that makes a difference. I hope it does. Here we go. All right, now we've got that sorted. Oh, way better. All right. And then Rita, you just get your your um wounds bandaged and we're good. Too easy. Craft some bandages, Rita, because then Nova can heal you. Oh, we discovered a juice leaf. Okay, we can do a healing balm, etc. Where's the juice leaf? Here you are. Okay. What's this? Oh, dead juice leaf plant. Well, we might as well cut it. Let's harvest these. Those ones look juvenile. Oh no, that's not. Okay, beautiful. Oh, we've also discovered all oh, the scarabs. Okay, that's fine. Is there anything else that we can make in the kitchen that we haven't already? So we've got our meat soup, our emergency rations, and our the tea balls. We'll also make some veggie sh veggie soup. Make it so that we've got four of those. Oh my gosh, look, were they always here? These tea trees here? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think they were, to be honest. Oh, and look, here's some more um, ben uh, cotton blossoms. There we go. Get some more of these too. Oh, we're doing so well. Right. I feel like... Who is... Oh, it's Rita. Jeez, I didn't know who it was. And I was like, who's at our base? What are you doing, Rita? Are you idle? Oh, maybe she's, like, having fun or something? She looks like... Oh, no, she's idle. 
Okay, Rita, why are you idle? That's the question, Reeds. Why are you idle? Alright. Rita, can you do farming? Where's Rita? Ranching, planting. Is that not planting? Hunting, harvesting, cutting. Why are you idle? There's heaps of stuff for you to do. I don't understand. We'll just see how that goes. Oh my gosh, guys, we're on day eight. Why are you I why are you idle? Maybe I need to manage your schedule. You should be either sleeping or working. Um alright. Nova. What should you be doing, Nova? Let's put you on construction. Put you on harvest and stuff as well. You know what? Let's just fill all these up because I don't want you to idle. Talked with Rita. Rita talked with Nova about their uncertain future. You're okay. Okay, here they go. Everyone's going out now. That's good. Alright, perfect. Let's make some healing balm. And we'll make it from the juice leaf as well. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, so I really need... I really need some extra wood. So who is a harvester? You. Please come and cut down this tree. Is there anything else that we can scavenge around here? I don't want to go too far afield. Aha, but I will if I have to. Let's see if we can get some weapons, I say. Oh, we got some skin bark. That's awesome. Skin bark will be really useful to make some leathers. Okay, so we're going to... Can I harvest all of these? Yep. We're going to harvest all of those. And we'll add this to our farm. I don't know why no one's farming. <laughs> I really don't. Um, but, you know, who am I to question? Wait, what am I doing? Skin bark. Great. There we go. Um... Let's see what else we can craft now. Veggie leather. Let's craft some veggie leather. Do it until we've got 30. That sounds good. And our production. Let's do a chopping block so we can get some sticks. We'll do that out here. What else can we do? Uh, we've got our fire. Uh, grave. We don't need that just yet, which is good. Ranching. We've got our drying rack storage furniture we can upgrade the beds when we get some um, skin bark actually leather no we don't need leather stuff a heating stove hmm increases the temperature while burning i wonder if that could be useful for us i don't know i'm not sure hmm, let's do it let's not do it for now Got a cook stove and our workshop. Defense. We could make. We could build a fence around here. Um, maybe we'll leave that for a little bit. Okay. Alright, everyone's up again. Oh, we finally got our research bench. Constructed. Okay, let's go to research. What do we want? Um, we can do tailoring, which might be good because we really need to make some more clothes, I think. Let's do tailoring first. Uh, we still don't have 
the chopping block done. What are you doing, Nova? Can you please do that? I feel like that would be quite good. And also, Nova. Oh, missing resources. I can't make the chair. What are you taking? Nothing. You're getting something to eat. Can you please mine the rocks there? And mine those rock chunks as well and then we'll have a few bits to make both the statue and the extra seat that we've got missing here oh okay so we're making sticks hmm you know what I've just thought maybe a chopping block isn't the best thing to do hmm because hmm no you know what I'm gonna put that on pause how do I do that uh, because I'm not sure that that's a good idea. I don't have much wood. Okay, so we've got a new plant silicon leaf. It gives silicon uh, and I can now plant silicon leaf. All right, beautiful. Oh my gosh, we're finally... Yes, go Rita. Look at this beautiful farm we've got going. Uh, I don't know what she's doing. She's kind of doing a little bit of a zigzag, but that's okay. I'm just gonna let the girl do what she does best. <laughs> All right, what else do so we've got? Kira, she, I mean, not Kira, God, I'm losing my mind. Krista, she is looking at these beautiful rounded cactuses, or cacti rather, sorry. What's Nova doing? Salvaging, that's very important. And yes, look at our fields, beautiful. All right, um, so the science, hopefully, it's too bad I don't have someone who is just like terrible at everything. You know, and they can just spend all of their time doing science. That would be great. If I really need the research done, that would be quite beneficial. Um, what can we do for the farming? Silicon leaf. Yep. While Rita's in the mood, let's just get her to do some silicon leaf as well. We may as well. I mean, it's not really... I don't see that it's costing us much now that it's done. She just needs to plant stuff, you know? What's she planting? Oh yeah, some grass risk of a meltdown. Krista, what's wrong with you, Krista? She's crushingly unhappy. Could develop a meltdown at any time. Alright, let's have a look at you. Um, hang on, where do I find out what's the wrong with you? Um, you seem fine. Your happiness is a little down. But at least you're having food in your belly. Look, your happiness, I think, is going up now. So I'm not really sure what's wrong with her. Um... Oh, here we go. Eight raw food. She's poor. Oh, she has less than 10,000 galactic coins. Sorry, sweetheart. And a disturbed sleep. I'm not really sure how we're going to finish uh, or fix the disturbed sleep thing. Um, I, I don't know how to put a door, quite frankly, onto your shelter. So <laughs> I think you're going to have to just suck it up, big girl, you know? Um... We could, let's put up a dartboard. That'd be quite fun, wouldn't it? Um, yeah, we'll put it near the chopping block that we're now not using. <laughs> um, great. And what have I got making in the workbench? Bandages, animal fats, trade goods. What did I say the trade goods we're using? Let's have a look. Stone. Um... Let's do stone and hay because we're now growing hay here. So I feel like that's not the worst thing to do. Let's mine a few more of these. How are we going on food? 307, we've got some meat. Um, dried meat that is. We've got lots of veggies, so we're good. Yeah, I like our little camp. I think we're going really well. Oh, we've discovered an oasis tree. Okay. Who was doing that? Krista? Where? Oh, that's right. The oasis tree. Yeah. All right. Let's cut down that. That'll be quite good. That. Oh, what's that? It's a dog. Let's observe the dog. Maybe we can tame it eventually. Actually, do you know what? That's a good idea. We need to observe the wildlife. Okay. Barrel cactus little round ones they can be eaten raw or cooked okay that's excellent let's add to our farm let's do some barrel cactus 
um, do some here. There we go. And what was the other one? The trees. The oasis tree. Ooh, you know what? That's going to actually be quite useful. Um, I don't know how many they'll get in there, but that's okay. Oh, someone's made veggie soup for the first time. That's awesome. Okay, so we've got four days worth of food, so I think we're I think we're okay. We seem to be going pretty well now, actually. I wonder if I should put a little fence around our sort of enclosure here and just leave the farming outside. Um, it's probably not the worst idea. Let me see. Um, it'll be defense. Ah, the fence is in defense. I'll get it. Okay, so <laughs> defense. Oh, we can do a sticks, sticks fence, a stick fence. <laughs> okay, so let's. Oh no, our stupid. Hmm. Our silly. Um. What's this thing called? A statue was gonna be there. All right, I'm gonna cancel that because I want to put my fence up. And then we're going to build that. So let's run it along here. Run it along the back here. There we go. Run it down here. Um, I don't know. Maybe just along here for now. Um, yep. And then here. There we go. And then we need to put some like fences, uh, fence, um, fences, gates into our fence. So let's put a gate there. We'll also put a gate here. Uh, no, we won't. What if I put the shelter over there? So let's put one here. And I also am going to put this fence gate, um, like a, that was a fence door, sorry, that I put before. Um, I'm also going to put a fence gate. So we'll put a wooden fence gate in here, next to the wooden fence door. Oh, look at them go. That's awesome. We'll have plenty of sticks because we're harvesting all this to plant those trees. So that's good. Yeah, I think that's good. Oh, aggressive animals. Where are they? But they are attacking that flathead. So he might take them all out. I don't know if you will, but we'll watch and see. Go bud! How many? There's a couple more. Hmm, I don't like his chances. Oh no, he's running now. That's definitely not good. Oh, Chris has reached construction level 2. That's good. I hope this stays closed. This wooden fence gate. Apparently I can close them. Alright, so where are they? Down here. Um, yeah, we'll be okay. Let's just... Oh, now they're attacking. Alright, let's grab our ladies. Come on, ladies. We really, really, really need some new... Um, some new weapons, don't we? Here come the bugs. There they are. Alrighty. Too easy. Oh, that was it. Ah, oh, perfect. Oh my god. Oh my god. How hurt did you get? Oh, jeez. That's no good. Oh, darn. Everyone's been hurt really badly. Um, yeah, we do have some bandages. Who was the lady? I think it was Rita who can make some bandages. Let's craft the bandages. Oh, Rita was healing herself. Whoops, I thought that was Nova. Nova, you should heal yourself, matey. Here we go. Heal yourself. Rita's going to craft some bandages so that you'll all be okay. Good on your reets. Look at that. Well done. Somebody's got dirty clothes. I don't, um, let's see. 
Okay, you do need... Ooh, dirtiness. Pa dirty pants? Okay. Well, we really need to really amp up our research. And by amp up, I mean actually do some. So we're going to have a statue of this thing. Eventually, I would say. Because they keep coming into our into our place. Alright, so who is... Nova is sleeping. Is she... Yes, yeah, she is recovering health. So is Rita. And what about Krista? She's fine. And she's idling. Okay, Krista, can you please maybe... Oh, she can't craft. Okay, don't worry about crafting. Can you... Can I force her to do science? Yes, I can. So please research the tailoring. That would be very helpful. Oh, I can't believe we're on day 12. We're doing so well. Okay. Alright, let's stop you doing that. Because I want to see what you'll do. Oh, you'll just go to sleep. Okay, whatever. That's cool. Okay, Nova's getting the cloth. What's Rita doing? Oh, she's butchering. That's great. Thank you, Rita. Look at all this yummy insect meat that we've got. That's great. <laughs> now, Nova, are you okay? Yes, your health's going up. You're fine. Great, look at this beautiful, yummy food. Look, everything's going well. Alright, this gate. How do I close it? Um, close. And I'll need a few more sticks. So let's get rid of these bushes. Oh, that's way better. Okay, and let's put another shelter on this side, I reckon. Krista is... At Oh no, she's going to melt down. What's wrong with you, Krista? Dust in the eyes, a few fun things to do. She's poor and she's anxious. Alright, well. We've got the dartboard. She obviously isn't a huge fan of that one. What about a punching pole? Do you think that'll make you happy? Could do. Uh, let's do that there. Let's see. What are you doing, Krista? Oh, she's now she's constructing the punching pole. That's good, because you'll probably want to use it, I'd say. What's she doing? Scavenging? That's awesome. Are you sleeping or are you dead? You're dead. Oh, now here's the manure. Let's observe the manure, because I'd really like to be able to use that. If appropriate, of course. You know, when the time comes. Okay, so, Rita. Okay, you're relaxing. Nova's relaxing. Krista's going to sleep. Look, all the... Everything has been, um... Transported to the buildings, and now we just need someone to construct them, which is great. I also want to put a wardrobe. Because... We just keep getting the sign that we've got too much um, too much stuff not enough space so if we build a wooden wardrobe um, hopefully we'll be uh, I'll mark it so that we can put clothes helmets shoes that sort of thing into it um, we need more wood do we okay let me harvest some more wood when I find some Any over here? I'm going to observe this guy as well. Oh look, there's another one. That's dead. Gee, something is just coming through here and killing everything. It must just be... Oh yeah, look. Oh, he's only got a shelf life of three. Don't worry about it. Okay, let's take out these. Oh, is that a dead tree? A fallen tree. Lovely. Let's cut that. Beautiful. Let's cut this little bit of hay as well, just in case we need it. 
Okay, everything has been constructed, which is great. Okay, except for the wardrobe. But once we get that wood, we'll have the wardrobe. I think, I think this is going quite well. We really, really, really need to be doing our tailoring. So I think I might get Nova to actually do stuff. She's chopping wood though. I'm going to get her to, oh, not Nova. Who's that really good? Is it Krista? What's she doing there? I think she's cooking. Um... All right, after you've cooked, I want you to research tailoring, please, Krista. I probably should make sure that she's the one that I want. Um, how do I see that? Nope, not schedule activities. Oopsie, it's Rita. Sorry, mate. I want Rita to be doing this. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Krista's like, okay. Look at base. I think our base is pretty damn good. I'd be happy with it. We've got oh you know what we can do? We can make beds. Let's make a stone bed with skin bark. Yes. Yes let's do it. This is so exciting. I'm just constructing them out here and we will move them inside. That's very exciting. And then the girls will be well, quite happy, I would think. Oh, the punching pole is... Oh, it's losing integrity. Is that because it's outside? What if we put it inside somewhere? Hmm. I don't think we've got any space for it to go inside. Does it go... no. Uh, nope. I'm going to have to make another. Hmm. I could extend the shelter. Let's do that. Let's extend the shelter. And we'll see if this works. And we'll put the punching pole over here. There we go. Oh, there's a heat wave. Okay, that's all right. I mean, it's, it doesn't matter. It's only a punching pole. How are our plants doing? We don't have any fertilizer because we haven't researched it yet, but someone is off to do it, which is great. Um, so everything is like at around about 10 to like 30% grown. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, okay, Krista, what's wrong with you, sweetie? Look, you're doing what you're loving. You, you're creating things. You love it. Okay, we've got our bed, so let's get rid of these beds. Um, deconstruct that, and that one, and that one as well. And then we'll move those beds into, into the shelter. All right, what else is happening? Nova is going to eat, I think. Rita is bringing some stuff over. No, she's scavenging. That's good. Great. Okay, the beds are removed. So let's move these beds. Now, they can't go next to each other. So I'll put one here. And I'll put the other next to it. There we go. And then the other one can go into, I guess, into the new, yeah, into the new shelter. Oops, the bed is upside, well, it's not really upside down, but it's going to annoy me. <laughs> oh, look at this, beautiful. Fantastic. Krista is still at risk of a meltdown. She's got no health conditions, but she's got 70% movement and 60% manipulation. I think that's because of the heat wave. I reckon everybody's got about that, yeah. 
cane. Okay, so we need to keep the tea up. Are we still making the tea? Oh no, aggressive animals again. Yes, I can see the tea is in the storage camp. A st storage camp. Storage place? <laughs> oh my gosh, there's 22 of them. Where's our camp? Over here. Oh dear. Alright. Uh, Rita, better get to making some bandages, please. Because... Wait, Nova's going to... Why are you sleeping on the ground? <gasps> what are you doing? Can they not... Can they not get in there? Hang on. Why is she not sleeping on the ground? Sleep in that stone skin bed. Um... What are you doing? Okay, that's just really weird. I don't know why. I have no idea why that's happening. Oops, what am I doing? No, I can't put it there. I have no idea why that's happening. I wonder if I could... Mm. If I put... Look, I'll just put the bed here. And I'll build another shelter. That is so weird. Why is she sleeping outside? What do we need? Sticks. Okay, got ya. Um, most of the bushes up here. There we go. It's just very strange. And Rita... Rita is sleeping as well. Okay, so the bed placement is definitely an issue. Um, let's move that bed ASAP. Okay, so the animals are attacking. Alright, girls, I need you all here. I wonder if we can use the fence to kind of act as a barrier to the to the beetles hmm let's try it so if we move here and if they're attacking may as well see where are they here they are hurry up go faster let's see all right Oh, I see. So they're attacking our... Uh, okay, it didn't really work. Could we use this as a choke point, though? No, because she's going out out the door. Mm, okay, it doesn't really work. If they all stand around together, though, it helps a little. So those guys up there are eating our plants. That's alright. At least they're getting more points into combat. Um, now we have to look on their profiles, do we? Probably. Hey, what are you doing sleeping on the job? Come on. There we go. Okay, and then the three of you go up here and take out these two. Or maybe just this one at the moment. Here we go. And then this one. Beautiful. Okay. So, another attack thwarted which is fine can you please make some more bandages oh dear everybody just gets absolutely pummeled by them now where's Nova oh can you please heal yourself Nova where's Krista can you please heal yourself Krista and Rita, can you please heal yourself? And then I think Nova is the one who is 
the least... Oh god, this is a medical emergency for Rita. Oh dear me. After you've done that, Nova, I want you to please make some more bandages. And the colony ship, right, what does the colony ship have for us? Bush fruits, juice leaf, etc. Um, leather, cloth, no, oh god, no apparel, no weapons. Damn, we haven't even made any of those trade things either. The little trade boxes. Ah, oh, done. Alright, can we... Can we sell anything that we've got an abundance of? Liquid fuel, cloth... Um, okay, we can only buy cloth. Is that what it is? Or they don't, they don't want to buy it? Oh no. That means we're selling it to them. Yeah, okay. Let's sell, like... Let's sell 50 to them. We've got leather. Let's sell... Ooh. We could sell all of our leather. The reason I'm thinking that is because we actually have the skin bark available to us now. Um... We've got these tea things. I don't want to buy, I want to sell. Okay, he doesn't want that. Let's do that. That sounds good. That's another 4k for us. Um, you know what? Krista's not doing it. Oh, she can't do that. Um, okay, fine. Whatever. What's this? What's this little guy? A red feathered bird. Very cute. Okay. Now, Rita, how are you doing, bud? Oh, shit. You do not look good, dude. Um, instead of healing yourself, can you please craft the bandages? Oh my god, can you just craft the bloody bandages? Can you please? Oh my god, what are you doing? <gasps> Why won't you craft the bandages? Oh, she's freaking transporting shit to the... Okay, whatever. Whatever, I don't care. She's playing darts now? Please craft bandages. Oh my god. What are you doing? I don't want you to play darts. Oh my god. Seriously. <laughs> Seriously. Your teammate is like going to die. <gasps> and all your... Okay. Can you... Do you... Ha are you conscious? Oh my gosh, Rita. You're gonna have to craft your own bandages because Nova is being a total cow and will not do it. <laughs> No? Okay, there's a problem here. We can't get to the workbench. That's what they're telling me. Can I put that there? Mm-hmm. Right. Okay, oh, I see the issue and the meat rack. Okay, so I've really buggered up the layout of this place. Okay. Um... I can, I understand. So let's move this. You know what? We're just going to move it to outside for now. And Nova is going to do that ASAP. Go mate, go. That's better. Okay. Now please craft the bandages. Okay. Oh no. Rita, hang on mate. Oh jeez, she's bleeding out in four hours, Nova. Okay, woofy. Come on, heal, heal her. Hold in, hold on, Rita, hang in there. She's our best doctor. Oh my god, oh my gosh. Feeding Krista, don't feed Krista, make some more bandages, mate. Go, go, go. No. Uh, unfortunately, Rita is gonna die. Damn. Ah, oh, that's such a shame. Alright, it was my placement of the shelters that... Wait! Oh, she bleeds out in one hour. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait, you've got medicine there. Oh my god, we've got medicine! Is it too late? Is it too late? 
Is it too late? It's too late, isn't it? Three, two, one, zero. Oh, sugar. E. <sighs> okay. We have to uh, make our very first um, grave. Ooh, that, that smarts. Damn. If only, oh man. Alright, the workbench wasn't in the right place. Okay. I can understand that. Nova. What are you doing? Craft some bandages and then save Krista. Otherwise, Krista's gonna just die. What's she got? Oh, she's got an infection nut. Damn, we were going so well. <laughs> we were doing so well. Look at them working. Aww. You're trying your hardest, aren't you, Krista? I mean, <laughs> Nova. <laughs> Alright, well, Rita's just um, on the floor, so let's... Uh... <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Oh, toxic ash? Being in the open during the disaster causes uncomfortable shortness of breath. Oh my god, and blood poisoning? Oh dear. Alright, let's see. <laughs> Where should we put the grave? Just up the back here? I think it needs its own little precinct, if you will. Um, let's just put them here, I think. Chris is starving? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh no. Rita, can you feed her? There we go. Okay, cool. Oh, there we go. See? All better now. What are you doing? playing darts no I think you should maybe construct the grave and then let's bury um, Rita I don't think it's right just having her there all right yeah you're gonna bury Rita that's a good idea matey oh no she's <laughs> to go and bury Rita but no she just decided to go to sleep <laughs> okay oh my god can you believe it <laughs> all right now that you've had a bit of a sleep can you oh no I just saw unequip yeah let's I know that's gross but she might actually have some good stuff on her <laughs> all right, Krista's all better, which is great. That's very good news. Why don't you drink some tea, Krista? Let's get some tea. Uh, drink tea. And then that might actually make you feel a little better. There we go. See? There we go. She's got some pain relief at least. Can we drink tea again or is that like a... You'll like overdose on it. Let's have a look. Oh, no. I don't think we can. All right, well, what's Nova doing? She's out in the toxic ash. Oh, she's got shortness of breath. Okay. Looks like we need to put a gate. Looks like we might need to put a gate up there. Remembering the dead, yes. Let's remember the dead. If it's gonna make you feel better um, so to be quite honest I'm not sure if the fence is worth it um, it didn't really do anything mind you I am only using sticks um, and the guys got through so okay what day do we make we made to day 17 
with only one death. That's pretty good, I think, at least. Now, what are you doing? I would love it for you to get up and do stuff, please. If, if you could, my love. Oh, she's still bleeding? No, surely not. What are you doing? Oh, she's eating. Okay. Um... We should harvest some of these as well. There we go. A food binge? Oh dear me. <laughs> if you could move that bed, that'd be great. Um, what do we need for this? We need sticks. Okay. So considering that Nova is the only one who's kind of half awake um, I don't know how how much further we can go Krista's eating everything Krista mate <laughs> Jesus well at least you won't be hungry I guess oh she's going to visit the grave yeah you know what we might need to <laughs> might need to build another one Um, there we go. We'll build it. I think they're facing opposite. <laughs> I think they're facing opposite ways. Um, if we could harvest these plants, that would be really good. Harvest. Does that work? Harvest them? I don't. I don't have a clue. Okay, why don't you go and harvest these, please? What are you doing, Krista? You're awaiting treatment. Can you heal yourself? Um, okay. Can you make... Da, 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 where's the bench? You can't do crafting. You know what? Why don't you just research tailoring, then? If you're... If you can. I think that's what we should do. I mean, you're only just recovering from stuff, you know? <laughs> You'll be fine. Oh my god, Nova played a funny prank on Krista. The girl is like really upset. Why would you do that? Do they hate each other? <gasps> no, they don't like each... Oh, wait. Krista likes Nova, but Nova doesn't like Krista. Oh dear. Okay, what are you doing, Nova? Okay. I'm not sure. Ah. Are we finally able to make this shelter piece? Awaiting treatment. What are you going to have treatment for? Oh. Everything. <laughs> Her feet. She's got severe infections. Severe and moderate infections in her feet. That's not good. Um, let's see if we can salvage this by using the first aid kits. And see if Nova can heal Krista after she's finished doing whatever she's doing. Oh no, aggressive animals. Okay. Oh no, there's 48 of them now. Oh no. Alright, I think this... <laughs> I think this is it. Oh no. Oh, Chris is up and about. Wait. Maybe. Maybe she's okay. I'll take the first aid kits off now. Does she still have her infections? No, she doesn't. Great. Look at that. Oh no. Those animals are going to wipe us out for sure. Oh, she's praying. Oh, I'm so sorry that your friend died. That's terrible. Oh, no. Okay. Alrighty, girls. One last stand. One last stand. It's like... I was going to say it's like Thelma and Louise. It's nothing like Thelma and Louise, to be quite honest. <laughs> Here we go. Make one last stand, kitties. Um, they're coming. They're coming. Look at them all. 
Here they are. Let's go. Attack, attack. Come on. Look at them. Look at them fighting bravely. Oh man, this is gonna be it. This is gonna be it. <laughs> this is gonna be it for sure. Here we go, first egg kits are enabled. <laughs> I don't know how many we've got left. Oh, we've got six. Okay. Oh my gosh, look at this. The girls are just trying their hardest. OMG. Uh, oh no. Okay. Yep. What are your injuries looking like? I know you just got better. Krista, I'm so sorry. Oh, legs, feet. Legs and feet for Krista. Okay. Come on. It's weird. It's like the bugs wait their turn. It's very strange. All right. She's bleeding out in 17 hours. Nova's bleeding out in one day, one hour. Oh no. All right. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Krista's in a medical emergency. 12 hours. No. Oh, there's our beautiful base. Fleeing danger? Why would- don't flee? You keep- oh sh- seriously? Mate, if you flee, they're definitely gonna eat you. Look at- look at this Nova is just- <laughs> Nova's just making a stand. Oh no, come on. Okay. Krista's- Krista's had enough. Yep, she's gonna die for sure. Nova. I'm surprised Nova hasn't started fleeing yet, to be quite frank. That's it, girls. Yep, Nova's fleeing as well. Oh, you know what? This was a great, a great attempt, I feel. We made it to day 19 at 2 a.m. Uh, I believe that is anyway. I would guess two hours, 2.19. Um, damn. Well, we tried hard. And we lost to some bugs. No. Destroyed fence. No. That fence was terrible. <laughs> the stick fence was terrible. Who could have called that? Oh no. Oh no. Look. Damn. Krista fainted. Oh. Oh no. So did Nova. Nova's fainted. Alright. What's Krista got? She's dead in three hours. Nova's dead in one hour. Oh, dearie me. Okay. I think what I should do is we can try hard difficulty with chaos, etc. I think what I want to do is try to do it on maybe a more forgiving map. So, like, I'm guessing something more like um, the Green Valley. I can't remember exactly what's that, what that's called. And see if we could do that. I mean, mind you, the desert's fine. It's just, it's just this weapon thing. I mean, I could, I could tick the box that says that everyone has a weapon to start, but I feel like that's just, that's just, uh, you know, besides the point. There goes Nova. Ah, oh, darn it, Nova. Okay, she's gone. We can put her, but we're not going to. <laughs> and Krista. Yep, okay guys, the bugs won. Are the bugs in the base? No, they're not in the base. Okay, well, they just want to attack the fence. Buddy, you don't need to attack the fence. Look, we've got a survivor here. Okay guys, I'm going to call it there because unfortunately... Oh, look at this bug standing guard. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to call it here. We had three attempts on the hardest, well I think was the hardest difficulty. We had the Chaos Moon, we're in the desert, uh, what else? It was an insane start. Um, and there was another one, no for this one I chose for the other ones I chose that there was zero skills. For this one I actually went with people's skills and it still wasn't enough. So I will be back. I'm gonna be back and I'm gonna try again on a different map. I think that we'll still have the Chaos Moon, we'll still have the Insane Start, 
and I'm going to try on the green kind of looking map where we've got a lot of wood and there'll be lots of food and things like that and we'll see if we can you know do better on that one I think it was the right idea building a fence etc but stick fences are just not going to do it um all right my name's Smocks from Celebrant Quest. Thank you so much for watching this ridiculous, idiotic, stupid <laughs> attempt at the hard difficulty. There we go. Krista's finally done. We have been defeated, but that's okay. It's all over. Um, all right. Join me in the next one. Um, I'll do, again, I guess, three attempts at the hard difficulty, um, but we'll do it on the green sort of lush map. Um, and see what happens. Okay, everyone take care. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.